What's up with you boys, man? It's your boy Don, man. So look, man, I want to make a quick little video, like a little food for thought and like how I'm feeling right now, you feel me? So pretty much, man. So like what I feel like what's going on in our generation, it's like the promotion of like feminine energy, you feel me? So what this video basically going to be about is pretty much just saying like stay in your masculine frame, like just be a man at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Like the purpose of a man, you feel me? So in my opinion, the purpose of a man is always like to self-elevate. You feel what I'm saying? Like the purpose of a man is always to be the most dominant, most highest version of yourself. You feel me? And I feel like in our generation, man, the way how they kind of like promoting shit is for men to be in a feminine energy. You know what I'm saying? To where like, you know what I'm saying? They want niggas to be like all lackadaisical and kind of like just distracted on social media, not trying to like have the entrepreneur mindset, not really have like the focus of a man. You feel me? I feel like the main focus in our generation is for us just really just to be complacent in life you feel me so like i just want to make a video just really just like discussing why i feel like as a man you just really supposed to be on your purpose and on your hustle like 24 7 like period you feel me because like at the end of the day bro like as a man you literally have one life and as a man you're just a creator you feel me you're supposed to like really just tap into yourself and just like be the most dominant version of yourself and challenge yourself every single day just to be one percent better you feel me like that's how i really feel as a man you know what i'm saying you're supposed to always constantly be on your hustle always constantly like self-elevating yourself you know what i'm saying because you know you don't really understand like how like life really could be if you understand what i'm saying like in our generation we it feel like motherfuckers really just want to wait on handouts you feel me and real life is not really set out to be like that so a lot of i see a lot of people really just like really not working on themselves a lot of people just really out here just like kind of like waiting for shit to come to them you feel what i'm saying and i want to make a video like letting you know like as a man bro like ain't really nothing gonna come to you in life you feel me that happens for women and that's why i feel like in this generation they were meant to be in a feminine energy and i, I see a lot of guys not really out here hustling trying to get on a pivot you feel me like as a man you control the outcome of your life because like it's real life bro you can really do whatever you want to do but you got to work towards that shit you feel me like the lifestyle that you're trying to live or whatever dream that you got in your head or whatever dreams and ambition that you got in your head bro it's attainable but you got to work for it and this generation is more it's more i feel like it's more people out here really trying to wait and receive versus go out and take go out and do you feel me like as a man it's for you to stick and stay into your masculine energy you know what i'm saying like i feel like you just need to tap into yourself, self-elevate, think entrepreneur mindset, and just be the greatest, most dominant version of yourself. Stay focused, stay, stay, stay in tune with yourself, stay true to yourself. You know what I mean? Don't be influenced by others. Just be yourself. Challenge yourself every single day. It's just you versus you at the end of the day, and just try to be the best you that you could be. Just be the best you that you could possibly be. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, bro, you only got one life. So why, why bullshit through life? You know what I'm saying? Because like, what you could do right now in your real life. Can set your family apart it really could like set up generational wealth it could really create a different lifestyle you know what i'm saying all that shit could really fall onto you you know what I'm saying? as a man it's really nothing that you can't do in real life as a man you feel me you're a creator you know what i'm saying like but like i say bro like this shit ain't gonna come from like nothing you know what i'm saying it's gonna take hard work it's gonna take days that you really work in 12 hours every single day you know what i'm saying but it's just the process the beauty of being a man you feel me it's for like me personally I'm really, my enjoyment of life, if I'm being real with you, my enjoyment of life is like really like hustling, like working on different sources of passive income. You know what I'm saying? To me, that brings me joy. I can't even say a lot to you. You know what I'm saying? Like me hustling and working, just striving to be in the best me. To me, that's like so fulfilling for me. You feel me? And I feel like every man feel the same way. Every man want to conquer. Every man want to build an empire. It's in our nature. You know what I'm saying? That's just what we are. You know what I'm saying? Just in our nature, just to conquer and just want to be the best and build an empire, building a franchise, you know what I'm saying? So, like, for me personally, I really love the fact, like, I could look back and I could see, like, you know what I'm saying, where I started from. And I'm seeing what I'm at, like, right now. You know what I'm saying? I could see where I'm at, like, right now. And then, like, I'm seeing where I'm going, you feel me? Like, so for me, it's so fulfilling. Like, you know, a lot of guys be looking, you know what I'm saying? They be saying they little shit, you know what I'm saying? They be like, oh you know why you do this why you do that da, 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 da. but the same time you could look at the same people asking you that you could ask them the same question why you still in the same position that you was in from five years ago 
You feel what I'm saying? And the reason why I'm making this video, because I don't want y'all boys to really just sit there and just let your life just fly by. You know what I'm saying? You didn't really like accomplish anything because you just being complacent. You're not really challenging yourself. You know what I'm saying? You live in a comfortable life and you just want to be stagnated. As a man, you should never be stagnated. As a man, you should never want to be complacent in life. You feel me? As a man, you just want to always just try to keep leveling up, just being the most highest version of yourself. You know what I'm saying? By knowing this generation, they kind of promote like being complacent. Just sit back on the sideline and watch. As a man, you should never want to be on the sideline. You should want to be out there on the field getting the shit done, getting your hands dirty, getting the shit popping. You feel me? But that's just how I'm feeling right now on Sunday. Just a little food for thought video. You feel me? Let me know how y'all boys feel about this in the comment section. And like I said, bro, I really appreciate y'all guys for really like supporting me and following me, like watching me grow and elevate. You feel me? But that's just how I'm feeling. I just want y'all boys to go out there and get this shit done. You feel me? As a man, you just really need to just level up and boss up. Because at the end of the day, the lifestyle that you're trying to live, it all based on you. You know what I'm saying? All this shit is attainable. You just got to put in the work and grind for this shit every single day. You feel me? And don't be like head ass with this shit before I wrap this video up. It's a balance with this shit. But just make sure you're getting the work done before the fun. You feel me? Y'all boys be smooth.